Yeah. Welcome to Cuban Sports Talks. I'm Kevin, and today we got our American Conference Championship prediction. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, join the Cuban Sports Talk family, and hit that like button. Let's get into the video. So. We got number 22, UCF, at the time I'm recording this, this is their rankings, versus number 19, Tulane. UCF is 9-3 and, and is 62 in the American Conference. Tulane is 10-2 with a 7-1 record in the American Conference. And that one loss that Tulane has in the American Conference is to UCF on November 12th this year. UCF did beat them 38-31 to in a shootout. That was the only loss Tulane had in the American. But in that game that UCF beat Tulane, Tulane lost the game because of penalties. And they had two costly turnovers, which were the problem. And cost Tulane to lose that game. But Tulane's QB, Michael Pratt, has been a solid QB this year for Tulane in that green wave offense. He is an arguably the best quarterback in the American Conference this season with 2,382 passing yards, 21 TDs, and only four interceptions. Pratt has been the leader for this green wave offense this whole season, and it matters on how, they, how he does for this green wave offense in this whole team and how he plays if they want to win this game. But going to UCF, UCS quarterback and leading rusher for the team, John Rice Plumley, is dealing with a shoulder injury. So he won't be as much of a threat running as he would be if he was healthy. But UCF does have a great backup, Mikey Keenley, in case Plumley isn't himself and can't play like he has this whole this whole season. But this is a great overall matchup through the stat sheet. UCF averages 34.9 points per game, and Tulane averages 34.4 points per game. UCF allows 21.3 points per game, and Tulane allows 19.8 points per game. But I think the difference maker in this game is going to be Tulane's defense. I think they have the upper hand in defense. They are led by their senior linebackers, which is Darian, Dorian Williams and Nick Anderson. Linebacker Tulane linebacker Dorian Williams is Tulane's leading tackler. He has 64 tackles, 4 sacks, 2 forced fumbles, and 2 interceptions. He has done it all this season. He has been that huge leader that Tulane's defense has and needed. And his duo, his linebacker brother is also another staple point in this Tulane defense. Nick Anderson is second on the team of tackles with 57 tackles and it has one and a half sacks and two forced fumbles. Both of these players are going to be the difference maker in this game for Tulane's defense. If they play like they can play, then they're going to be an amazing, I feel like they're going to win this game. Then we have UCF quarterback John Rines. Like we talked, I said earlier, he's dealing with a shoulder injury. It depend, UCF offense depends on if he can play. If I, I personally think if he can't play like he can play, like he's played this whole season, then I don't think UCF can pull this victory out. And yes, they may be, they, their excuses in a way could be because, oh, we didn't have our quarterback, our star quarterback that's been leading this team this whole season, which is a respectable excuse, which is a respectable thing like that. But I think that he will play pretty well. I honestly think that he's going to play pretty well. And if not, then they have Mikey Keeney as a backup, and I think he's going to do amazing. But I think that overall, I believe that Tulane is going to win the American Conference Championship and beat um, UCF this year. I think Tulane has been a great, solid team this whole season. And a lot of people didn't think that Tulane would win this conference. I thought a lot of people were saying it was going to be Houston. I know I said it was going to be Houston. A lot of people were saying UCF and Cincinnati. Those are going to be the top three. But me, I think it's going to be Tulane beating UCF in the American Conference Championship. I think the final score will be a lot like the first game. Like I think it's going to be a shootout. I think it's going to be going to be. I believe it's going to be not like high high scoring, but I think it's going to be 
both teams are going to have over 30 points. I think it's going to be like a 38 to like 35 game, 38 to like 31. Like maybe this like the exact same score as last game they played each other. I think it's going to be a really close game, but it has the potential to be a two score game victory by Tulane. I honestly think. But that is my prediction for the American Conference Championship. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, join the KBN Sports Talk family, and hit that like button. See ya!